So what is the main reason that you're here? Yeah, my back. Um, I stopped playing for like a month and then I decided to go out and just go as hard as like play all out. Where do you feel it? Point again. Oh, so here's I my see. spine and it's like right here. Yeah, that's huge. Do you mind me lifting up the shirt? Yeah. Yeah. Right here. That's exactly where it's at. Yeah, and then here's the compensation down here into the QL. Right here. Like, especially after I, like, go to the gym or something, this, okay. I, it'll shock me. Like, I'll move, do something, and then I'll get shocked, and I'll get stuck for, like, two to three seconds, and then, you know, it'll be fine. Is it just local pain right here? Right in the middle at your spine? It's, like, on that. On, okay, this is what we call the vertebral, yes, the vertebral prominence. Is just it, look down right now, look at okay. anything. No, look anything. back. Look... <laughs> You're getting ahead of me. <laughs> Look back as far as you can. Oh, okay. That it's stuck. Could that choose there? Okay, so you go yeah. to the gym at five. In the morning. I've never experienced that pain outside of early morning. Okay, so what happens early morning is sometimes the discs are really hydrated. When you get up, the body is so, for lack of a better term, juicy yeah. that stuff is might hit the nerve. Okay, so if I take the tension off of it, usually I can improve. You know, you won't feel that shocking pain anymore. I'm just going to test this just to make sure you've got some, it's not something more serious in your neck, okay? Yeah, you're fine. Ooh. See that's that? Solid, yeah. That's cool. All right. Um, if, there, if at any time something is uncomfortable or something feels odd to you, you need to let me know, okay? You okay? I'm fine. I, 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 I can feel the face. <laughs> got to work on its neck. Right hand side. Woo. Uh, like <laughs> up here is like I've never experienced that. <laughs> the wind is so strong today. So if you hear the building creaking, that's what that is. Okay, is it getting a little easier? Mm -hmm. All right, let's get the adjustment out of the way. Oh, wow. There you go, first adjustment. Never had that in my life. There you go, not bad, not bad at all. Didn't hurt, right? Oh, that it felt alleviating. Yeah, it's just real good. Chin back. Oops, oh. <laughs> so I just get it. Now I'm gonna really go at it, okay? Here we go on that right hand side. I don't know if I can get it though. I don't know if I can get it. <laughs> yeah, I actually feel it. The adjustment is pretty powerful. It'll drain on its own. It'll leave you right there, okay. We do the toes real quickly. <laughs> I'll think that toes moved in a while. Ever. <laughs> it felt really stuck. stuck. Ankles. I'm sorry I didn't warn you. <laughs> <laughs> oh. No. Um, reach up your head and grab the table for me. Like give me some counter force. Ooh, got your hip there. There it goes. Feel like a spring? Yes. It should feel like it, it snaps back. Good. Bend your knee. Let's test it. Is it hurt? No, this is just gonna be fun. No, no. It's okay. And good. Everything's set in place. I'm not gonna pull it, which is what I think you thought I was gonna do. Nope, fibula. It's fine. Good. Yep, you can let go. Any pain when I do this? Bend your knee. 
I'm gonna press on. I'm gonna press right here. Right. Any pain? Okay. In your low back or anything? No. Other side. Any pain? We have way more flexibility over here, though. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I didn't realize how tight this was until I put my hands on you. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds wrong, but that's the truth of it. Here's a green roller, okay? Breathe. There you go. There you go. Never had any kind of work like this either. Never. How are you doing? I feel great. Okay. I'd be here a little bit. This is, this is, wow. That's what you're talking about, huh? Yeah, actually. Yeah, okay. But it starts up here on the left-hand yeah, side. Yeah, it does start up there. Yep, yep, right here on the left. Because some days it'll move like up and down that. I'm sorry, what it, is it? It'll move up and down, like depending on like what I did that day. So it'll move up and down from like here to here. Okay. Breathe. Keep breathing for me. It's like going over speed bumps. Just keep going. There you go. Flatten them out. They're a bunch of muscle spasms. You've got a lot of them. Mixed in with some scar tissue. We're about to see it in a second. The shirt is kind of covering it. Uh, uh. Yeah, that was one. He's, he's keep on creaking. I know, the wind is so bad. What can we do? Again. Perfect. Good. as tight as you are your bones move just fine okay that's a good sign all good things deep breath in here's that one that zings you I'm saving it for last all the way out perfect perfect okay no big deal it's nice to be 25 but he's supposed this is riding so high that in order to make that straight your spine that that's, straight. that's how much force I have to apply Wow. All right. Oh. Breathe. When the leg goes. <laughs> no, you're fine. It's basically, you're going to see his muscle ripple. You can see the lateral curvature here. Very good. Breathe. Take some deep breaths. It's gonna three times, three passes, and that's about all I get out of it. One. Ooh, man. One. That was crazy. <laughs> what you want to fix that? That yeah. thing is huge. Ah. Last one. Most painful. Here we go. Oh. What is that? Rhomboid. Adhesions. Done. Infraspinatus over here. 
And there's no little trigger point in here like we had over here. And I think that is coming from this glob of glue here. <laughs> yeah, it's not over here. There you go, Brian. Oh, there it goes. Oh. Doesn't hurt? Does it hurt? Feels good to me. Look at that. Huh? Huh? Well. I know, look at that. Like instantly. Look oh wow, way over here. Okay. Okay, not hurting you, right? No. I mean, I'm barely putting any pressure. Feel it coming out. Wow, oh, I'm barely even pushing that hard at all. Not like with the other scraper. What the only problem I see is I can't get into the little crevices. But for the most part, it's doing a good job. Now this one, I can't quite get into that one. So I'm gonna do, I'm gonna switch to my other one. He he's, uh, has developed paraspinal muscles and I need to get right next to the spine. So I gotta get in like right here. What's a paraspinal? Paraspinal, so here's the spine, right? All right. Para, okay, or like next to, got it. or sitting alongside of. And I can't, with the bar, because it, it's straight, mm -hmm. I can only go over the side-by-side -side muscles and I can't get close to the spine. But trust me, it took a lot of the workout. So I like it, I like it. I have to do, come up with a new style of scraping, some new, with some new tools. <laughs> Done. I know, it's like right in the armpit. <laughs> <laughs> but if you want the scapula to move correctly, we're in the armpit, <laughs> okay? And this has a nice curve, so I can just go right along the ribs like that. Get a little bleb there. Ticklish? No, that feels good. Okay. But no anesthesia. This is just what we do. Yeah, I don't feel anything. Like, until I see it, I won't even know that anything's been done. That's brutal. It's always the worst the first time you get this done. It honestly feels good to me. Yeah, yeah, we're moving that fascia. You know, they call it fascia mobilization. Mm -hmm. That's what we're doing. We're getting that skin and muscle connective tissue gliding. And, you know, stag blood stagnation comes up through the skin. So that's what we're all oohing and aahing over. A little ticklish, I'm sorry. <laughs> You've got a little deep one here. <laughs> Oof, all right, all right. Three times, and then I'm just gonna, one, maybe if I just push, two. <laughs> it is tickled, it doesn't hurt. Sorry, <laughs> yeah, it's just, that one's down in there. Okay, let your arm go, let your arm go. Does that hurt too much? No, it doesn't hurt. It's the only time I ever ask you guys to look down. I just never felt that before. Yeah, there's a huge hickey over here. <laughs> it's not over here, it's that way. Oh, but it's at the top. Yeah, the top. That's where, like, when I told you I never felt anything like that, like, whenever you, wherever you were touching, like, above it, that's where I was actually feeling. Yeah, feel it. It's right by your hairline, though. Am I pulling out your hair? No, you're not. My son is always like, you're pulling my hair, man. <laughs> Yeah, so okay, press your forehead into my arm. There we go. Now I can push into it. No, nope, push your forehead. Yes. He's like, let me get it. <laughs> relax, relax. Okay. Mm. 
Okay, well here's that injury. So let's see what happens. It feels like an injury to me. That definitely saved me time, that bar. Wow. Oh. You know, with the gloves, I, I, I'm not afraid to like feel it. <laughs> You'll see it in a second, you're like, what is she talking about? <laughs> I'm really, I'm clueless. All right, come on and take a picture of them. Oh, wow, that's awesome. No, this light red will go away. The darker spots are what take like four days. And then your back will look perfectly normal. It's not like we hurt you or anything, yeah. but about four to days to a week, that all that stuff goes away. Yeah, how does it feel? Yeah, I feel something cool right I mean, it feels good right here, right in this area. I feel less tense here, I don't know. Just well, like, we, I'll let you have it, you know. Yeah, go ahead, like. Just what I'm noticing like with my moving. Right. That's cool. Yeah, you just gotta unglue it. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta unstick it. I'm just gonna wipe all the oil off of you. I'm surprised it's not stinging as you wipe. Since, like, you know. <laughs> it's not coming through your skin. It's just staying right at your skin in the dermis. I'm wearing gloves because it's once in a while somebody bleeds. And there might be micro cut. You know, I don't know. It's just you're supposed to be extra safe. All right, go ahead and put the white shirt on for me. Good. Oh, no adhesions down in the low back. Very good. There you go. Head off the table for me. The table? Give me the shoulder. Yep. I know I kind of pull you towards me, but the top half of your body goes back off the table that way like that way okay. lean backwards is what i'm talking about there you go Ooh, that's awesome that was awesome <laughs> there you go that was literally like that spot i told you that hurts that just like that's red it felt great other side <laughs> same thing the head off the table again backwards that was awesome. <laughs> <laughs> your back on your back. <laughs> Bend both of your knees. <laughs> like that, there you go. <laughs> you're gonna push out against my arms. Um, oh, okay, okay. oh yeah, yeah, you're gonna like go yeah. out with your legs. One, two. Yeah, squeeze. Squeeze my hands. There it goes. A little bit. Very good. Um Come on and sit up. Here's all the cracking, <laughs> right? Yep. You sit up straight. That's all it's gonna go. And then you're going to same thing. Elbow back. Oh, there it goes. Yes. But this one I want to check. Okay. Very good. And lean away. Good. Do you crack your fingers? Yeah, on a daily basis. <laughs> <laughs> There's only one thing I saw that just humor me. Um, just pull on these. I, I notice you're twisting. Just straight axial. There's no proven research on it, but I've just seen in my own practice that people that twist their fingers like that, they can tend to have arthritis in the tips. All right, come on up and see how it feels. We still have to stretch, but. Oh, wow. All right, back. <laughs> it feels good, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we just gotta work on getting your chest out. Okay, and that's what we're going to do the exercises for. Okay. Right, we're good with you. 